giving greetings to all my listeners in the precious name of our soon coming Lord and our Savior Jesus Christ. May the most holy name of our God Almighty be magnified. Today's devotion is from Psalm 72. The title for today's message is Glorious and Golden. Even though this psalm starts with a prayer for the earthly king, the rest of the verses speak about the millennial kingdom when the Messiah shall reign. Jesus shall reign the earth. Peace and prosperity shall flourish. He shall be ruling with justice and righteousness. Poor, oppressed and needy shall be protected and well taken care of. His presence shall be beneficial and fruitful to all as the showers of rain on the weary and dry earth. By his righteous rule, he shall bring peace to the whole world, not just to one nation. Everyone from far and wide shall come to him joyfully in reverence. Even the enemies shall bow before this glorious king. Poverty shall vanish. He shall rescue the poor and the weak from cruel treatments and show the world the oppressors how precious everyone's life is. The unkind and the unjust world shall be defeated by this glorious king and his righteous kingdom. Creation and creatures all shall marvel and be blessed rejoicing under his rule. David is longing for this day. He is earnestly praying for the fulfillment of this prophecy and promise of the millennial period. The fallen world and sinful mankind are empty and restless and hopeless without the glory of God. May we who are believers in Christ, dear my sisters, may we submit ourselves to Christ as David does. May we glorify him for his marvelous redeeming love shown to us at the cross on Calvary, thus making it possible for us to partake in the righteousness and peace that he gives us, even today in this sinful world and for all eternity. May we continue to pray and work for the salvation of everyone so that they may also become partakers of this joy and peace through Christ. In verse 19, we are called to bless our God in Christ for what he has done for us through Christ. Blessed be our God. Praise the Lord. We as redeemed children of God are blessed indeed. To have a little taste of that glorious kingdom and golden period even now on the earth through our Lord Jesus Christ. Blessed be the holy name of our Heavenly Father, the God Almighty, forever and ever. Amen.